Really? The important thing to remember is that you always come really soon to crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't know you were uh, filming or you got a permit. <laughs> I'm sorry to disturb your comedy folk banter. <laughs> what? Calm down. No. I'm not a good thing. No. Um, my name is Mr. Dick Hickson and I'm from Off Folk. We are the regulated body for acoustic and roots music in the UK, currently incorporating off jungle. And I'm here to do an inspection. Oh. Now let me see if I've got this right. You are the, um, the Lancaster slot jockeys. Close. 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 I must make it very clear, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, sorry, gentlemen. That uh, I'm very thorough. Okay. You see, I've just hopped onto the team from the Folk on Strength Festival, where I've had to uh, shut down the grumble weeds because it clearly states in the off folk, the regulatory body for acoustic roots music in the UK, currently uh, incorporating off jungle manual that when constructing a set list, one must clearly mark when and where you are going to be using a comedy banana. I hope you're going to read that song. Because if not, I've got a question for you. Is your banana in Shoei? Cheers, everyone. Let's have a little drink before we get cracking. Woohoo! Cheers. I hope they're all in plastic bottles. <laughs> Is it me? Is it warm in here? Very, oh, very anyone. sticky. Well, let's not get bogged down in the weather. Let's get swimming in uh, five of the major drink groups. These are bitter, lager, cider, cider. ale and stout. Stout. Don't be afraid to sing along. Here we go. That's not right. Let's see ya. Singing bitter lager, cider, ale, stout. Designer drinks, a rather drink nose. You can keep your white wine spritzer, baby sham. That's for your sister, order that in Lancashire, so let you out. I took Jean to Pig and Elba for us tea. And some bloke ordered a double UKD. Oh, the filthy swine. Well, I didn't know what to do when Big Frank ordered Malibu. I tried to explain to Jean, but she, she just couldn't see. And that's because somebody was walking past and just jabbed her in the eyes. You were blind. Sinking bitter lager, cider, rail stout. Very aggressive. Designer drinks, I'd rather drink now. You can keep your white wine spritzer, baby sham. That's for your sister, order that in Lancashire, so then you're out. Right, here we go. Everywhere I turn, I see these alcohol pops. Alcohol pops! All the kids are drinking and hanging round the shops. Round the shops! Let me be the babysitter. I could get them on to bitter. No more ass balls, just barley, wheat and oats. Come on, let's see you clapping. Bitter lager, cider, ale, stout. Designer drinks, I'd rather drink now. Spritzer, baby sham, that's for your sister, order that in Lancashire, so then you're out. Like second a bit higher. Bits of lager, cider, ale, stout. Very good. Designer drinks, I'd rather drink now. You can keep your white wine, spritzer, baby sham, that's for your sister, order that in Lancashire, so then you're out. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. That's how you start a party right there. There you go. With a new one and, uh, and an old one. Easy. Welcome, welcome. Don't be shy. Come on in. A couple of latecomers here. Don't, we'll edit this bit out, don't worry. Don't worry. 
Yeah, and if we do make any major mistakes on stage, all that will happen is we'll replay the song again. I'm reckoning we're going to get out for about three, maybe four in the morning. As long as that's all right. The magic of television, that's right. OK, then let's crack on. This is where I'm going to ask you to, be, to do a little bit of audience participation. It's dead easy, this one. It's a bit of waving and a bit of clapping. That's all I'm going to ask you to do, all right? Follow Dickie, all right? He's going to show you what to do. This is a song called I Fear... I care, that's all. <laughs> now let me tell of a shop that fills me with dread. It's blue and it's yellow, but I always see red. There you go. It's a furniture store that makes me want to shout. Cos once you've entered, you can't find your way out. That's why I fear Ikea I won't go there again I don't want a bookcase called Billy Or a table called Sven Just don't go over Sandy If you don't like the queue And that don't include Thower Sat on M62 If you go over when well, it just makes you laugh Cos it's the size of Belgium Mother's no bloody star That's why I fear Ikea Come on! I won't go there again I don't want a bookcase called Billy Or a table called Sven It's a good ten-mile walk If you just want a shelf Hang on! You want me to go in warehouse and pick it myself? Well, I struggled with trolley. I didn't get very far. And the boxes were that big, they didn't fit in the car. That's why I fear Ikea. Come on. I won't go there again. I don't want a bookcase called Billy or a table called Sven. Michael Palin, he's travelled the world once or twice. We said, why don't you explore Ikea, Michael? That'd be nice. Well, the men of the bee must have been off the reds. He went missing a week ago between kitchens and beds. That's why I fear Ikea. Come on. I won't go there again. I don't want it's called Billy On a table Called Sven And again That's why I fear I kill a time I won't go there again I don't want a bookcase called Billy On a table Called Sven Yes, cockers. Hey, it's going all right, isn't it? Only five mistakes so far. Brilliant. And they were all from me. Yeah. Can, can I just say this is the most friendly Alcoholics Anonymous meeting I've ever been to. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. I'll show you what I'm, uh, where I'm going to be. Just, just this way. Okay, sir. Uh, watch your feet on there, mate. Not, not, not tacked down. Then they'll, they'll be gaffered down. This one is wine. That one as well. That oh, mate, watch that as well. Nearly, nearly it's gaffered. I'm like that down. Gaffer. So, hey, what's going on here? Bolting. Well, is it flammable? No, that's all. Up, that. That's all been fire retarded. It's fine. It's, oh. just, it's just, it's just to bring the stage to life. Bit Ret of light. Retarded. Okay. Uh, so this is where I'm going to be. It's, yeah. It, uh, it's not very complicated. Just my little thing for putting me tin on there, so okay. I don't have to bend down for the, for me back. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, and, and very simple set list. You know, an assortment of plet try. Just a one instrument. Will you not be uh, twanging your banjo tonight? No, not tonight. Just. Just the guitar. Just tonight. the acoustic. Yeah, yeah. Is that and that's all right? Is it the stand's all right? You're the stand's all right. I just, uh, well, to be frank, can you show me your fingering technique? Hey, Lowry, could you please welcome to the stage Pirate Bernard? What shall we do with the drunk and sailor? Oh, what shall we do with the drunk and sailor? Oh, what shall we do with the drunk and sailor? Oh, early in the morning, hooray! Up she rises, hooray! And up she rises, hooray! Yeah! 
that's about 50% of you and it simply will not do. So let's try that again. When you see the cutlass drop, I want to hear you say, Kya! Kya! That's much better, at least 98%. There's a bloke back there who's lost his voice. That's not his fault, but we can, we can overdub. We'll, do, we'll double track. The, the okay. thing is, we, we were just doing an accident group advert. Now we're doing a gay chat advert. What's going on here? If you want to meet pirates in your area, text hook to 85473. Have you got your telescope, Birded? No, no, it's gone. It broke, broke, broke yesterday. Poundland's finest telescope. Yeah. Quality product. Actually made things look further away. It was rubbish. Right. You're not hit back to front. I'll start doing the voice now. Believe in the character. Let yourselves go. The reason I'm here, thanks for introducing me, Dickie Ticker. The reason I'm here, dressed like this, sweating profusely. <sighs> wow. It wasn't warm enough. Stupid. Right. The reason I'm dressed like this is because I'm sick to the back teeth of going to the cinemas to watch rom-coms. Can I get a car? Yeah. I'm sick to death of going to the cinemas and being forced to go to the pick and mix where she only chooses pineapple chunks, cola cubes, and the heavy stuff she knows it goes on weight. <laughs> How many times, woman? The accent will naturally dip, don't worry. <laughs> Rice paper, flumps, laces, as many of them as you want. Put them on the counter, still, Forty-four ninety-nine. Can I get a QR? Yeah. What I suggest is you become a cinema smuggler like me and get a big coat with no pockets in. Should have pockets in, really. A big. <laughs> believe, just believe. Well, CGI them in, don't worry. <laughs> and I suggest you smuggle your own sweets in. <laughs> now I could drop that at any time, but I still want you to say QR. Yeah. That, that will go throughout the song. I'll, I'll try and catch you out. She's called Cinema Smugglers. Well, we all like the cinemas and going to the flicks, but I won't pay a tenner for your ruddy pick and mix. And popcorn's over for a pound a bag, so I'll become a pirate and smuggle in some swag. With a shiver me, Pringles and a yo ho ho, we bring our own sweets and they'll never ever know. We smuggle in our own confectionery, ah, cinema smugglers we be. I'm gonna bust a little bit of moonwalking just for you tonight. Here we go. And that's why I'm looking after an animal, you know. Now me hearty smuggling's a dangerous game. You might think it's a little bit risky. But the staff are only paid the minimum wage. So they're hardly gonna frisk me. If you've got rebels in your pocket, Maltesers on your shirt, then you'll walk in a very strange way. You've got to be careful of the noise that you make Cos that's really gonna give the game away Right, Dickie, we're going to watch a film Perhaps it's the new Superman I don't know, whatever's on at the time And you've brought festive Pringles on the hottest day of the year Get them in your jacket, come on, it's got starts, here we go With a shiver me Pringles and a yo-ho-ho We bring our own sweets and they'll never ever know We smuggle in our own confectionery Yeah, cinema smugglers we be what we're going to do now, ladies and gentlemen, is we're going to have a QR off, all right? Top circle only, after three. One, two, three. That's not bad. That next one down there, whatever that one's called. After three. One, two, three. Simply wasn't as good, was it? You'll admit that yourselves, won't you? Now, just round the back at the back here, just round the back, not the floor just yet, just round this bit. After three, you ready? Oh, you're, you're, that was close, that's close. Now this bottom bit here, don't let yourselves down, there's more of you, are you ready? One, two, three! Yeah. Oh, very good. I brought Smarties, Rollos and chocolate eclairs, I'll eat so much I'll be ill. I've got more sweets in me pocket than rolling from Grain Jill. Topical. While I'm watching the trailers and the films are about to start, there's a sense of trepidation. But watch out for the noise from your rappers, boys, if you've smuggled in at summer celebrations. 
With the shiver me Pringles and a yo ho ho We bring our own sweets and they'll never ever know We smuggle in our own confectionery Yaha! Cinnamon smuggle as we be With the shiver me Pringles and a yo ho ho We bring our own sweets and they'll never ever know We smuggle in our own confectionery Yaha! Cinnamon smuggle as we be Yaha! Cinnamon smuggle as we be Let's have one big last cure at the end. Larry, would you like another song from Pirate Bernard? Yeah. Thanks. His, his tail's come off. <laughs> Rubbish. Can't keep this up any longer. Right. Thank you very much for asking me to do I'm not doing the voice. Thanks very much for asking me to do another song. This one does involve you standing up, all right? So I do apologise in advance, but if everybody could stand, even if we get a little bit of house lighting, please, just so I can make sure everybody's doing it. Let's have you on your feet. Mum, Mum, you can stay where you are. Yeah, you stay You don't need to get up, Mum. My Mum's in, everybody wave at me, Mum. There she is. Hey, up, me Mum. <laughs> now, if you could just now believe that you're at the last night of the proms, right? And for some reason we're on. It could happen. It, you never know, right? <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to play a song called Perfect Pint, all right? And it involves you bobbing up and down like they do at that prom thing, all right? <laughs> all right? It's going to get a little bit quicker. This is your workout. I know. I want you to feel some of my hot pain, all right? And I'm going to sing as fast as Buster Rhymes. Chicka, 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 chicka. Yes. Okay, boys, hit it. Get ready. I'll use my arms to show you when you're bobbing up and down. Here we go. There's a lot of drinks on sale behind the bar And whatever you choose tells us who you really are But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter is the perfect bar You can pull a pint and drink a pint and not one back I can have one with you and then I'm gonna get you one back But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter is the perfect bite You're in the swing of it now, get ready, it's gonna go a little bit quicker There's a lot of drinks on sale beyond the bar And whatever you choose tells us who you really are But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter is the perfect pint You can pull a pint and drink a pint and not one pint I can have one with you then I'm gonna get you one pint But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter is the perfect pint Larry, can we go a bit quicker? There's a lot of drinks on sale beyond the bar And whatever you choose tells us who you really are But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter is the perfect pint you can pull a pint of drink, a pint of not one pint I can have one with you, then I'm gonna get you one pint But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter in the perfect pint Surely we can't go faster than that! There's a lot of drinks on silly on the bar And whatever you choose tells us who you really are But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter in the perfect pint You can pull a pint of drink, a pint of not one pint I can have one with you, then I'm gonna get you one pint But you'll never go on better than a wet a pint of bitter Cos a better pint of bitter in the perfect pint Ladies and gentlemen, could you please give it up? For the scourge of Cine World, the Bourneville Buccaneer, the biggest fudge packer on the high seas in terms of confectionery, Pirate Bernard. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. And give yourselves a round of applause. That was wonderful, that was. Very well good. done. Brilliant. Well done. We have activated the Kenny cam on top of Kenny on drums there. So if, if anybody does. Uh, need their face pixelating in terms of, you know, invalidating their disability living allowance, just please send us an email. Send us a tweet. It's basically like a, an alcoholic drummer version of Babe Station. That's what it's like. So it, it, it's going. Are you enjoying yourself so far? Yeah. I feel after sat now, Bob singing, Pirate Bernard. You're all settled down. Oh. Bernard. Bernard. You're okay. You've missed him. Who? You've missed him again. Pirate Bernard was here. Oh, no, he wasn't. Oh, yes, he was. <laughs> Rubbish Unbelievable. <laughs> Just a reminder at this point that tickets are non-refundable. Thank you. Hey, trust me, I've tried to get mine back, so, you know. <laughs> right. This one does involve... Um, some more audience participation. You've been very good tonight, but this one you can stay sat down. It's just a bit of shouting. That's all you've got to do. Right. 
And you can feel free to shout all the way through this next song because we don't play it particularly well and it'll make it a little better. True. It's a song about people who can't talk proper like what we do from where we live, right? <laughs> You've got your people selling the big issue who, from a distance, it sounds like they're going... Cheap. <laughs> Rubbish. Incomprehensible nonsense. You've got the man who's selling his newspaper down the high street. It may be called the Telegraph, the Standard. What do you wear? You wear something like... <laughs> it, it doesn't make any sense, but I've had a good listen, right? I've had a good listen and I've twigged in and I know what they're all saying. It's like a secret code. They're all saying the words hip meadow, right? That's true. You have a listen to them. There's another example which might make a little bit clearer, which uh, Bob's going to demonstrate over here. The old club singer. I've got to take my mic off for this. Yeah, so I'm going to yeah. Careful, Bob. Way up. Don't mess the bunting up. Oh. Hey! We're not doing well. Dicky Ticker. Have, have you been Where's the gaffer? Guess where the edit point's going to come. Have you been to a gig? Hold on, get, get, it in, get it in. Hold on, Baggy. And how do you think the show's going so far? Rubbish. <laughs> so we're to not, get we're back all to it, aren't we, ladies and gentlemen? We are all. We ain't hurting. We'll just cut that in. No. As I said, this is a song called Hit Meadow, and feel free Rubbish. to just randomly shout it out at the top of your voice, right? But as I say, here's another example. All right. Action. Very good. Please release me. Hit it, it was worth it. You've Isn't got to get in that. It Isn't was it? worth it. That is not available as a download. <laughs> oh, thank God All right. For that. So this is called Hit Meadow. And seriously, do feel free to just shout it out at any point. All right. Starting now. There oh, you oh, go. Oh, That's oh, it. Feel, feel free just to pull the Hit Meadow. Over. Just get it top of your lungs. Don't worry about it. There's a man who on a Sunday drives up and down and past our house In his flatbed transit van For miles around you can hear him shout What's he shouting? He is, that's exactly what he's shouting. Sat on railway station platforms, it's someone selling local news to advertise his paper gut. He shouts the paper's name, he wants you to choose. And you know what the paper's called, don't you? He sees you dead right, it's called Hingo! In a run-down labour club stands a figure with his mic in hand. For 20 years he's crooned along, supported by his backing band. And you know what songs they're singing, don't you? Gangnam Style. That's no, no, no. That one by Daft Punk. No, no, not that new no, one by Daft Punk. He's singing in the From the scrap metal man to the newspaper tights and the labour club scene. Let's have a listen to what they're saying, here we go. We say scrap metal. They say hit metal. We say evening standard. They say hit metal. We sing unchained melody. You shout hit metal. They're absolutely bonkers. Let's have another big one shouting on. From the scrap metal man to the newspaper out.
Thank you very much. Give yourselves a round of applause. Now, what I'd like you to do is uh, a little bit of spelling with your arms, all right? So a little bit of house lights again, please, sir, if you'd be ever so kind, so I can see the people who can't spell. You've no need to stand up, don't worry. No, 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 no. All right, make sure you've got your um, drinks down, because you could get somebody wet next to you, all right? So first off, let's spell the word, or the, the acronym YMCA, all right? Y is here. You've all done it. That's it, there we go. All the people who think they're too cool, come on. There we go. M, if memory serves me right, was somewhere there. C, doesn't, don't worry about which way, don't poke anybody in the eye, there you go, C, there. And A is up here, isn't it? That's right, well done. What I'd like you to do now with me is spell out the word chav, all right? <laughs> Horrible little creatures, all right, but uh, this song should clear up some problems. First off is a letter C. C, there it is. Well done. H will probably just look kind of like that, very good. This is quite good, looks. I'm enjoying this. A is in the middle again, and then V, open them wide to the sky, like a Y, but don't worry about it, all right? <laughs> and once you've done that bit of spelling, I'll give you the shout, and shout chav with your fist in the air at the top of your voice like you want to rid them from the bus shelters and top shops of the world, all right? Out! Here we go, this one's called chav. When I was young, I remember very well Boys were boys, and girls were girls It was clear, you could tell But nowadays I'm not so sure The fashion's up the wall And it's wrong There used to be a clear line A definite divide But now the line is smudging Sometimes I can't decide when I'm underneath the tracksuit and the baseball cap's a boy or a girl. Here we go then with the spelling, get ready quite slowly. C stands for clones. H horrible. H arrogant. V very annoying. Get ready for shouting, what are they? Chaff, 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 chaff. The congregates in bus shelters are outside the top shops. It's getting sore, you'll need Jeff Cates to walk you to co-op. Cos it's just not safe with them around, they're annoying and they're rude. And it's wrong. When the tracksuit's all fake Burberry, or even in a hoodie, the bullying and the swearing, like a Lancashire Jane Goody. And they just don't serve a purpose They should bring back national service for, for them all Right, you know what's coming this time, everybody? Here we go! Here we go! C stands for clones H Horrible A Arrogant V Very annoying Shout it like you mean it! Go on! Shout! 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 Get to bed, bugger off, move along, bloody chaps, bugger off, move along, get to bed, bugger off, move along, bloody chaps, bugger off, move along, get a good time, get to bed, bugger off, move along, bloody chaps, bugger off, move along, get to bed, get ready for some spelling, C stands for clones, H horrible, A arrogant, V very annoying, what are they? Cheers, Cockers! Thank you very much. A round of applause, too, please, for Mr. Kenny Boddy on drums there. <laughs> Chav is normally his Achilles heel, and I thought he did rather well. Red leader, this is the Baron. Hello. Yeah, coming in, yeah. I'm activated, how are you doing? Yeah, just phoning in my report, sir. Yeah. Uh, well, it's worse than I thought. Yeah, yeah, I mean, like you, sir, I, I, I read the review in Reader's Digest and they gave them five stars, but the Mickey Mouse outfit, this, sir. Oh, the, the, these jokers are giving serious sport fans like Chonky Fettle a bad name. They are, sir, they are, yeah. Uh, you what? He, he's done what? I, I don't care if he's John Paul Jones or not. If he's not got a licence for the mandolin, then he can't go on stage. Flouting and laws. Who do you think he is?
three, two, one, you're back in the room. There you go, ladies Hello. and gentlemen. Now, unfortunately, uh, uh, when we were doing the, uh, the DVD, the one thing we didn't actually do is notify Off Folk, the regulatory body for acoustic and roots music in the UK. So we've got an Off Folk officer that's come in to inspect the gig. He's not happy with the bunting, especially after the little, the little incident with Bob. So he assures us for legal reasons and to comply with, with the Off Folk regulations, the bunting has to go. It's a little, it's a little bit less showbiz, really, isn't it? Is he happy now? Thanks for that. Thank you Ruiner. very much. Well, it feels, it's, do you know what, though? It feels a lot more open, does it? It's like oh, it your does. part of us now. There's no barrier. We've let you in. That's nice. Don't steal out. That's his job. I'll How is everyone, by the way? I mean, we sped through the first half. We, we, we could do with a, a, a new section of the show called Aya. Aya, you're all right. You're all right. Aya. Before we get cracking, let me direct you to the attention of this uh, very attractive Hard Days Pint uh, Hot Pots Pint Pot. Oh. Are they available this evening, Bernard? Well, they very well may be, yes. <laughs> I'd see that. And if they were available, how much what might one be? Well, three pounds for one, four for a tenner. That's because your Hot Pots oh. value, ladies and gentlemen. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to have that on stage either because it's glass. So oh. if, if Mr. Offort would like to come in uh, and take that away from me, because it could kick off, couldn't it? What if, what if I just got annoyed and I could just... I'm not going to down it, leave it. It's got to be safely disposed of, so, so I'm led to believe. Well, it's all right, because when one ends, another one starts! <laughs> the most beautiful <laughs> sound in the world. So we were in Blackpool last night, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah, it, it, it really is as grim as you'd, you'd expect. Little bit of guitar there, sir. There she is, okay, right. And you got a present, didn't you, Bernard? Right, there were two ladies who were in the balcony, right up in the gut, and they were dancing, they were getting a little bit overexcited, and they were of a certain age, and I said, if you keep dancing like that, ladies of your age, you can be prone to a little leakage. It's medical, so you're, you're allowed to say it. Just so. make sure you've got your tenor ladies on. Well, much like every game, we go down, we do a bit of signing at the end, and she's come up and she's signed a tenor lady out of a bag. She I've got it with in my box, unbelievable. But that just up. goes to show you the class of people that Keep you get in. But unlike your good selves, ladies and gentlemen. Salt Keep your knickers and bras, don't throw them up, just throw up medical waste. <laughs> shocking, shocking. We'll make a quilt. So are you all suitably refreshed, ladies and gentlemen? Because it is, it is warm. I don't know whether it's warm for you down there. It, it, you know, the, the bright lights of showbiz are on us this evening. It does tend to, especially if you're wearing necker scarves, make you sweat a little. Were the, uh, were the beer pl prices reasonable? Oh. oh. Staff, it might kick off. <laughs> oh, get, open the doors and then just let them funnel out to bargain booze. Dear God. <laughs> This next song was uh, covered by a man who was on Britain's Got Talent years ago. What Real was his biz. name? Mr. Zip. Mr. Zip. There you Zip. go, that's showbiz. That's showbiz for Where is he now? Because we're at the Lowry. <laughs> He's on the bins, so... I think we had the better song called Keys Wallet Phone, didn't we? Did. We? we did. And that's the name of this next song. It's about forgetting your keys, your, your wallet, and your... And your that's all... Hey, you're getting in the swing of things now, ain't you? Let's try it after three. Let me hear you say it. One, two, three. Please, it, okay, let's have a little crack at this one. You know what it calls on Sunday night. Your drinks are flowing fine. Put scratching smile the pickle day. Put landlord shades for time. time. Let's get these drunken head for once. He's lost control of her knees. And as I get to run it on, I realise I've lost me keys. Whoa, there's a famous phrase in Lancashire that you can sing with me. It isn't hard to learn at all, and when you do, you'll see three simple words to say out loud before you wait for all. How does it go? You know it. A restaurant, the perfect place for me to treat the wife. You choose the wine, I'm having stout. Yeah, can't I drop me knife? And after four chocolate mints, I say, no, I'm paying for it. And then I go and realise, no, I'm not, because I've lost my wallet. Whoa, there's 
was a famous phrase in Lancashire that you could sing with me. It is an art to learn at all, and when you do, you'll see three simple words to say out loud before you went for all. Everybody! Keys, what it for? The holidays are here again, up cut off and up to car. I've got a pitch in Skeggy Me, it isn't very far. I set out long ago, look at traffic, he thought he had no Now cars brought down Rick Far SA, no, I've lost me fall. There's a famous phrase in Lancashire that you can sing with me. It is an art to learn at all, and when you do, you'll see. Three simple words to say loud before you went for all. One last time, keys one Cheers, cockers! We got the hit. Yes, boo him. The more, the more important thing to realise is that Billy spilt some beer, and that's a sackable offence. It is in this band. <laughs> no, we've got a few dancers down this side. Sorry, well done. Sorry. We're missing a few down this side, and the next song is a bit of a rock and roll jivey number. So I'd, I'd like to see a couple of people having a bit of a dance down there. Don't be shy. You've paid your money now. You might as well try and enjoy yourself. I know it's difficult with the quality of the entertainment, but just come on. Let yourselves go. I got Bob's being a bit Mariah Carey. He wants to wipe a guy at again. Yeah, there's, there's spillage down oh, there. Oh, there's a spillage well. behind the bed. Come oh, on, Mr. Dickinson. No. There's going to be nobody left in the van. So he's actually the, uh, the felt guy stroke slave. There he is. Oh, and he could. <laughs> well, you could have done that ages ago. <laughs> <laughs> and he's Man, right. He, you'd have been thanked. Right. Who's had the last laugh? This next song is about a, uh, about a situation that I got into with my wife, right? She decided that she started to love little furry things and she didn't want to eat them anymore and she went all vegetarian. No, boo her. Because we all like a bit of bacon on a Sunday morning, don't we? Oh, yes. Slap it between some bread, brown sauce for breakfast, get it in, bang, meat, right? So this song is called, uh, it's, it's all about that uh, time where she tried to turn me vegetarian also. This is a song called Hardcore Quornography. It's a rock and roll bluesy number in A, all right? Watch me for the changes. When the wife told me the good news, I were red over reels. The local pig and elbows finally doing meals. To keep the missus happy, there's just one thing for do. A pint each, candles, table for two. I said, what do you fancy, the pork, the veal or the place? She said, I won't eat anything with a mother or a face. She's turned on vegetarian, what we're at to do? And if you want your wicked way with me, you'll go veggie too. I was in a spot of bother, I don't mean to say nesh, but it's either Mackie D's or the pleasures of the flesh. I've been having Sunday fry up since the day I was born. I've got no blooming option. Hardcore quad. I'm into hardcore and I've got me free. I miss me bacon, but he's just how long gonna last. Though the steak and kidney puddings are a thing of the past. With that sausages and burgers, I am all for all. What's she got me into? Hardcore porn. Tofu? What's that sports for do? It's like putting rubber in me gob. I had to wince when I ate soy and mint. I want a noshin on a sausage, but I'm gonna have a job. She tells me eating meat is eating animals. And if I sneak out through a kebab, then she'll smell it on my breath. If she suspects they're fish and chips, she might as much as touch us. She may not find out to eat that girl from the butchers. Me heads in bit but please answer me this. I know you're vegetarian, but can you still eat fish? I'd murder for a burger, yeah, yeah. I'd kill for a mixed grip, yeah, yeah. I would die for a pork pie, yeah, yeah. Chop off my leg for a scotch egg, yeah, yeah. But if I eat meat, then me bedroom privileges are withdrawn. I've got no blooming option. Hardcore quad. I'm a hardcore pornography. She's got me vegetarian, I got me free. I miss me bacon, but it's just how long can I last? When the steak and kidney puddings are a thing of the past. Without sausages and burgers, I am all forlorn. What's she got me into? Hardcore quad. Linda McCartney, God rest her soul. But there's something she could never understand. A man has needs, he don't want for his 
scenes And if I saw that Bernard Matthews Just a shaking body And I want steak, gravy steak Sing it! I want steak, gravy steak Let's hear it! I want steak, gravy steak Steak, gravy steak hey. But I'm a dead man if I eat meat I have been warned It's one to all lentils with me Hardcore quality Me bacon but he's just how long can I last? Then the steak and kidney puddings are a thing of the past. With our sausages and burgers, I am all forlorn. What's he got me into? Hey, we're getting there now. We're getting lively, aren't we? I like it. What a, I like it. What's a lovely bunch of hand jivers? Uh, well, some of us already are. All right, cheers. That's Obviously. my chauffeur over there. <laughs> <laughs> He's there on the stage. Presumably, you mean little Johnny Green. He'll be out shortly. He's just having a little rest. All right. Believe you me, you don't want to see Little Bird on stage. That's, <laughs> when, that's when the editing no really way. has to get. That's a separate. Thing. We've all we seen it. We have all seen it. Oh dear. I'll drink to that. Unbelievable. I thought Jeez. you were supposed to be better than Blackpool. Yeah. Mine's in the gutter. Just don't Google it. Right. Okay. Shall we have another fast one? Another drinky one? Have we got anyone in tonight who thinks that they're a good drinker, they're good at it? OK. Do you think that if there was some sort of drinking sport, you would win a medal? Do you think that if we hosted some sort of competition of drinky, olympic -y things, you, you could be a gold medal winner in some sort of... I'm rambling, beer Olympics! I know who will win a gold yes. medal for drinking. Olympic -y things. Olympic -y things. I don't know. What do you call that? Big film this. Let's go the dilly, 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 dilly. What's that called? Jogging. I don't know. There's a governing body that for you, jogging. You don't see that on the telly. The weather. Yeah, we've just got a few cloudy and sun things here. Sunny you know. things and cloudy things and There's Olympic -y things. Doing. So you might have already guessed. This next song is called the Beer Olympics. It's another club banger, it's, it's another big fast one, so feel free, people the, uh, uh, the, on the balcony bits, you can all stand up because there's nobody behind you and have a little jig, don't, you know, help yourselves, just don't fall this way and, uh, and hurt yourselves, all right? Mum, Wait. if you want to start a mosh pit, feel free, just, so just dive mosh. over there. <laughs> Bring your oxygen with you. <laughs> Come on then, here we go, this is the Beer Olympics. Oh. Just how did we ensure that we took gold? But then I had a thought, make drinking beer an Olympic sport. And now, let my master plan unfold. Larry because sing. I want to put drinking beer in the Olympics. We'll all be world-class athletes, you and me. We'll drink till we're unstable and be top of the medal table. So I'm going to the bar for Team GB. Well, I could drink ten pints, that's in me vest Trying to break your personal best But even me medals for you and at the KFC From now on, going out on the lash We'll all be funded by lottery cash So I'm going to the bar for Team GB So getting bladdered now becomes intensive training And I'm exercising at the pub week in, week out And I've got on a retainer Johnny Vegas is my personal trainer. We're drinking bits of lager, cider, ale, and stuff. You know it. Come on. I want to put drinking beer in the Olympics. We'll all be world class athletes, you and me. We'll drink till we're unstable and be top of the medal table. So I'm going to the bar for Team GB. Bit of quiet, some commentary. Yes, sir. Gymnastics. Let's check on Kenny Body in the vault. Oh, I'm told he's actually no longer in the vault. He's actually in the lounge and he's undertaking these synchronised drinking. Let's share the marks of the judges. 5.6, 5.7, 5.9% alcohol. He's done it, Lowry. Go! Well, I could drink 10 pints, that's in my vest. Trying to break my personal best. But it would be medals for queuing in the KFC. From now on, going out on the lash. We'll all be funded by lottery cash, so I'm going to the bar. Team GB. No drinking lager, the 
Germans, they'll be competition. Achtung. And for vodka, the Russians would put up a fight, I guess. If he dies, he dies. But drink it till you're chaotic. We'll finally be patriotic! Hey, hey. Has anyone got St. Cole's email address? One more time! I wanna put drinking beer in the Olympics. We'll all be world class athletes, you and me. We'll drink till we're unstable. And we talk with the men on table. So I'm going to the bar for Team GB. Chris Sakabusi, alright. Cheers, me dears! Thank you. Mumford and Sons would kill for a song like that. That's proper, isn't it? Proper. <laughs> Listen. My impression of Mumford and Sons, but yeah, I like them. <laughs> they stole our idea for waistcoat. We've been wearing waistcoats longer than Mumford. Tonight's not really like Mumford and Sons, it's more like Mumford and Puns. <laughs> Thank you very right. much. One rehearsed gag, we've banged it in. Done. <laughs> Listen, there's a little young man back there who's very excited to see you. Oh. So let me just go away and just, uh, and just bring him on. But let's have a little bit of quiet, because he's ever so shy. A little, little bit of hush. Little, don't mention little Bernard again, please. <laughs> we almost got round that one. Bernard, is he ready? No, he's not ready. How about if I do... Bernard, is he ready? Right. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, it's little Johnny Green. <laughs> Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse. Hey! We've hit the sweet spot, we really have. Those words again, tickets are non-refundable. That's right. And can I also say DVD purchases are also non-refundable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right then. All right, little Johnny. Yeah, 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 I'm all right, yeah. Oh. What, why are you shy? Oh, I'm just all emotional, I don't know why. Oh. You, you... You look like you look like you've turned. Well, you're different than last time, aren't you? I've turned emo. Watch the watch the legs, son. Watch the yeah, legs. No, no longer is he little Johnny Green. He's now little Johnny Green Day. Can I just admire your ventriloquism skills, there, Bernard? Oh yeah. I try and get as close to the mic as I can, so you can't see my mouth. Is it working? It's actually no. no it's up. not. You look rubbish. Thank you. Just believe. Just, just let yourselves go. Disney on crack. That's all it is. <laughs> just let yourselves go. No. Leg, legs. Sorry, legs. If, if he doesn't mouth the words in time, he's had a lot of cowpaw. His legs look limp there. He's fine. He's fine. He's just heavily sedated. Don't worry. Because his nerves kick in. Shut up. Get on with the song. All right. They don't want to hear you. They do. They bought tickets. Some of them got free ones. I know. 50%. I know. Right, so you're going to sing uh, He's Turned Emo? No, I shall sing the choruses. Right, all right then. So, when little Johnny Green Day sings the choruses, if you could all give him a big cheer, because as we've said, he's ever so shy. All right. So when he sings the choruses, you can all cheer like they do in Westlife when they stand up off stools. <laughs> Let's have a practice now. For no reason at all, why do they do that? Right, I'll just go and sit down there. When I stand up, give it some. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> So this song's called He's Turned Emo. Let's get on with it. All right, cockers! All right. Now, my mate Jeff, I've known him for years. He loves his Madonna and his Britney Spears. Then one day, I noticed a change. He went all moody and he didn't look the same. His eyes looked black, I said, have you got a shiner? When I looked closer, he were wearing eyeliner. He straightened his hair and come it over his eyes. And all like a goth and he's let himself go He used to be listening to Simply Red Now he's listening to Fall Out Boy instead well, he weren't at the Labour Club for our regular line dance. He just stayed at home and listened to my chemical romance. I said, you're not an emo, let's forget this misdemeanor. Come with me and see Cliff Richard at the MEN Arena, he said. I'm feeling all emotional, I don't know why. I said, it's those tight trousers that are making you cry. Come and have a pint of mild and you'll feel fine. And listen to ABBA, not bullet for my 
theme tune as well. Did you like little Johnny Green Day, ladies and gentlemen? He's lovely. In fact, one of the girl, lady technicians is actually who saw him last year came down from the rival production of Siegfried next door, which is a, an opera. He's actually on for six hours just to come and say hello to little Johnny That's Green. a bit heavy, isn't it? Six hours of shouting. Hours. Hey? That's how much rehearsal we do a year. <laughs> He's imagine, not lying. Imagine six hours of this. Oh, no, 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 oh. no. How many cans is that? <laughs> <laughs> I shudder to think. Right, we're going to move on now. The next song's proper dancey, right? So it will be another stand-up and you can groovy groovy. There's not room for a conga. There really isn't. There really Mr. isn't. Mr. Dickinson from our folks said that the conga is out, I'm afraid, this evening. Mr. Dickinson, he says, conga, no, dancey, yes. So we've got the all clear for the dancing. Before we play that, we're just going to go and put on something highly visible for you. Just to, you know... We, we've bought them, they were off uh, t bays three pounds, so we might as well wear them, didn't we? All right. Let's have some costume changing music. <laughs> No wonder Kanye West is angry all the time. Good Lord. You know if Dizzy Rascal did your bins? <laughs> Feel myself getting loose just wearing it. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. I need to ask the audience a question. Did anybody go uh, to the Hacienda back in the day? Yeah. Have we got any old bowlers, posse? Yeah. <laughs> Not Crown Green bow uh, Bowlers, the, the, the rave club. Got to make that distinction quite clear. We all like a bit of rave, and we hope you like a bit of rave music too. Some highly visible people in there, see the reflections off your jackets, or are you just health and safety? Are you with Mr. Well Dickinson's there, staff? Oh, yes, oh, there are some more, yes, some more highly visible men. You're not wearing yours, a bit warm. It is a bit warm, and so you could slip it on now while we've all got ours. We'll wait for you, don't worry, everyone. <laughs> we'll edit this it's bit out. It's your time worry. you're wasting. Can we just press pause? <laughs> Very nice. Beautiful. <laughs> so like I say, let's have some house lights up so we can see everybody having a nice dance. Let yourselves go. This song's called Lancashire DJ. Here we go. I'm a DJ and I'll make you dance with a little bit of techno, a little bit of trance. Play anything that you like from Eric Prince to Paul Van Dyke on two turntables and a microphone. I'll play some house for your auntie Joe. And I'll just stay for rock the place with a little bit of hardcore drum and bass. In 88, I were on a vendor and I ended up at the Hacienda. Summer of love, you want to be there in her all ace music, smileys and flares. And that's so hard, I split me kecks. The very next day, I bought some necks. And ever since that fateful day, I've been a Lancashire DJ. I'm a DJ and I'll make you dance with a little bit of techno, a little bit of trance. Just play anything that you like, from Eric Fritz to Paul Van Dyke. Got two turntables and a microphone. I 
playing some heist with your auntie Joan I know just stay for rock the place With a little bit of hardcore drum and bass no. The wife is baking cakes I'm down the labour club playing breaks And every Tuesday at the old folks' home I play on passions and they never mourn I sometimes go down to the vets For one to be four hour take no sense I got a PA from a young Kalani We'll have a midnight rave at the Cash in County I'm a DJ and I'll make you dance We a little bit of techno, a little bit of trance Play anything that you like From Eric Prince to Paul Van Dyke Got two turntables and a microphone Play some house for your auntie Jo I know just stay for rock the place With a little bit of hardcore drum and bass Well I've always asked for requests I haven't always gone on but I do my best My auntie Mabel loves KLF But I have played it loud Cos she's half deaf <laughs> Funk of the favourites of Mr Patel But he listen to a little bit of favourites as well Nearly give me grandma a heart attack When I cranked up the hits from the basement jacks I'm a DJ and I'll make you dance With a little bit of techno a little bit of trance Play anything that you like From Eric Prince to Paul Van Dyne Got two turntables and a microphone I play some house for your auntie Joe And all just stay for rock the place With a little bit of hardcore drum and bass And now let me hear you say Time, ladies and gentlemen. Dicky, you're enjoying that that much. His hat fell off, look. For the first time ever, ladies and gentlemen. He's on Smiley Bandana now, and that's it. Yeah, boy. <laughs> right, feel free to get yourselves all sat down again now. It won't kick off for about another three songs, so you're all right. Is anybody in a better seat than they were when they first got off? Yeah, one of the benefits. Well done, you. Yeah. Party Dickie's back in his box now, ladies and gentlemen. Sensible Dickie now. Has Dickie got any uh, professional business you might like to talk uh, about now? Later in the show. You're going to cross later. that bridge a little later. later. In the show. All right, so, uh, oh, oh, I like to see that. It's, like, it's not like when they ask a big question on who wants to be a millionaire, see that? Diddly diddly do. Is there an appropriate sound for that? I could do with a faster thing on it. No, no. There's no sound, no. so... Edit, edit. Can you play an inappropriate Who Wants to Be a Millionaire sound? <laughs> oh, that's not too bad, is it? We're out of time. Sorry, everyone. Good night. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the business in hand, Bernie. Yes, quite literally in hand. Nice pun. Did you intend it? No. Because we can't script these things. <laughs> this song is about a handheld video games console. Made by Sony, it's called the PlayStation PSP. You put games in it, you charge it up, you do that, it brings some sort of enjoyment to uh, young people. And this song's all about that, it's about nothing else, it's just about that. Here we go. I've got a confession to make for a man of my age. Now, young lads play with it all the time, they think it's all the rage. They do it in the bedroom. When the mum and dad's in bed Grown men like me should do it Cos we've got wives instead I've tried talking to the wife But she doesn't understand The pleasure that it gives me When I hold it in me hand The longer I play with it The more it gets hard Especially when you've got no memory On your memory card Started one day, I got a bonus from work. Two hundred pounds for the wife, she went berserk. She sent me down to B and Q to go and buy some shelves. But I spent the cash in game station. She played very hell. See, I got myself a PSP with a couple of great games. 
And ever since I bought it, life hasn't been the same. She wants me to the gutters, in it only take a day. But now I'm wasting all my time playing GTA. Oh, my PSP, my PSP. It really is fantastic, it is the one for me. I'm glad I saw it in the shop, just sitting on the shelf. Cause now I get so much pleasure playing with myself I've tried talking to the wife But she doesn't understand The pleasure that it gives me when I hold it in my hand The longer I play with it, the more it gets hard Especially when you got the memory on your memory card Well, wife is getting fed up now Never come to bed. I just sit on the sofa and play FIFA instead. She puts on sexy underwear and gives me come to bed eyes. But kid, don't run, I've got to beat him. He's on to level five. Call me PSP, me PSP. It really is fantastic, it is the one for me. I'm glad I saw it in the shop, just sitting on the shelf. Cause now I get so much pleasure playing with myself I've tried talking to the wife But she doesn't understand The pleasure that it gives me when I hold it in my hand The longer I play with it, the more it gets hard Especially when you go got no memory on your memory card And then one night when me and wife were cosy lay in bed she whispered softly in my ear, and this is what she said. Darling, I've been thinking about our bedroom fun and the pleasure that you get, you know, by moving just your thumb. Well, I bought me sell a present to keep me entertained. I'll confess that it takes batteries, and I'm sure you won't complain. I couldn't think of what she'd bought, but I didn't have to guess. Cos right then, she pulled it out, a Nintendo DS. I tried talking to the wife. And now she understands the pleasure that it gives her when she holds it in her hand. The longer she plays with it, the more it gets hard, especially when she's got no memory on her memory card. Proper ending, isn't it? 13 endings to one song. Brilliant. Just a chance to get it right. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> right. Ooh. I'm ever so warm. Are you warm? Yeah, it has been. It's been a warm morning. How about another drink, ladies too. and gentlemen? Cool oh, you down. Okay, yeah. yeah, cheers, everyone. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Listen, and you will. No. As I look at this piece of paper that uh, Dickie's done on his word processing program, it's, it's near the end of the gig now. Say it isn't so, Bernard. It isn't so, Dickie. We've got a couple more, then we'll go off. You launch here, we'll come back on, we'll do some more. Yay! That's Them's just how it works. That's how it works when you're treading the boards. We've got a question for you, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. Is there anybody here tonight who's, who's in a job that they don't like? Yeah. Yeah, yeah me and all. <laughs> Whenever we ask that question, there's always certain members of the audience who just stay silent. What do you do? <laughs> what jobs do you do? Let the rest of us know. <laughs> it's always worrying when the sound man shouts at me. <laughs> sorry, board. Sorry about it all. Right. Anyway, listen. For those people, it is just some advice. If you're in a job that you don't like, you've just got to you start taking little perks. Just start stealing. Simple as. That's all you've got to do. Nobody will know. A pen here, a paper clip there, a laptop here. Don't worry about it. Slip it in your bag. They'll never know. And this song's all about that. It's called The Perks of the Job. It will involve you doing some monumental waving. All right. Hit it, boys. Can I just say, I'm from Liverpool. I cannot condone theft. There we go. Or working, so. <laughs> I'm not in a job I don't like. 
In fact, if there are any people who've taken any pictures tonight, please pixelate Billy Matt because he's... Uh, is a disability allowance and the job centre my could, could you uh, could you CGI some crutches in? <laughs> <laughs> he relies on that thirty-seven thousand pound a year. He really does. <laughs> me, me and Abu Hamza. <laughs> to be employed there's lots of ways the company gets you annoyed you change your hours in your shifts you get so down hearted you've not had a pair eyes since you started but if you don't like it the firm will give you the sack but did you know there's a way you can get your own back your dignity's been robbed and nobody cares so what you've got to do is steal something of theirs it's called the perks of the job i'm a work and i'm on the run I'm gonna take whatever I can fit in my pocket To make me feel better and they just can't stop it I'll be stuck in this job till I reach my old age Wouldn't do it if they paid me a decent wage Till they do, I'm gonna go to town And help myself to anything that's not nailed down Revenge against the company, tastes delicious But don't take too much too soon or they go and get suspicious Stuff that people won't miss or there'll be tears I've not bought paper for me printer for about three years Don't get cocky and put a laptop up your sleeve Just a little bit of something every time you leave An envelope a day, that'll never be missed There's more stationery in our house than in WH Smith's It's got the perks of the job I'm at work and I'm on the run I'm gonna take whatever I can fit in my pocket To make me feel better and they just can't stop it I'll be stuck in this job till I reach my old age Wouldn't do it if they paid me a decent wage Until they do, I'm gonna go to town And help myself to anything that's not nailed down But if the thought of stealing sends you out of your mind There's other ways you can get your benefits in kind Use work phone, call your mate in Timbuktu Or an hour on your Facebook page you'll do Now here's a top tip from me workmate Shirley An excuse to give your boss, you know, if you want to leave early Tell her you've got to go home because your kid's got a terrible cough Either that or say your shed roof's been blown off It's got the perks of the job I'm at work and I'm on the rob I'm gonna take whatever I can fit in my pocket To make me feel better and they just can't stop it I'll be stuck in this job till I reach my old age Wouldn't do it if they paid me a decent wage Until they do, I'm gonna go to town And help myself to anything that's not nailed down It's all the perks of the job I'm at work and I'm on the road I'm gonna take whatever I can fit in my pocket to make me feel better and they just can't stop it I'll be stuck in this job till I reach my old age Wouldn't do it if they paid me a decent wage Till they do, I'm gonna go to town And I'll be stuck to anything that's not nailed down Go! Thank you, thank you. Very decent of you, very decent. Right, this is it, this is the end. This is your last chance to dance no. before we go off and come back on again. So please, make most of this moment, right? I want you to go proper bonkers. Thank you for coming out and supporting us yeah, tonight. Yeah, cheers, cockers. Thank you very much. There's over 25 of you in here and it feels amazing. So thank you very much. We'd like to give a little bit of a gift back to you now by playing Chippy Tea for you, all right? <laughs> if you want to give us a bit of house lights, it's dead nice. And is it all right if I ask you, will you, like Robbie Williams does with Angels, because he can't hit the notes, we'll ask you, if, can you sing the chorus? Because I can't remember the words. Is that all right? <laughs> Similar but different. Thank you very much. We'll see you all again soon. We've see been like Lancashire Pots. You've been fantastic. <laughs> and this is Chippy Tea. Come on!
Well, it's the end of the working week. I'm rushing back on quick. I'm starving out for a clem and all I could eat a buttered brick. I need stodgy food without the fuss then. Why gives me a plate of couscous? I said, I'm sorry, love. I want a chippy tea. Larry, let's hear ya! Save your booze for the band. <laughs> now, my name is Mr. De Kixon, and I'm from Offthorpe. We are the regulated body for acoustic and roots music in the UK. We now incorporate Off Jungle uh, because of cutbacks. I need to conclude my inspection. I need to make sure that entertainment and enjoyment has been taking place in this room tonight. So I've got three questions for you. No, because you're not on stage. <laughs> First question, are you having a good time? Yeah. Second question, do you want your money back? No. Too late anyway. <laughs> Third question, do you want more? Yeah. I'll conclude this inspection at the end of the gig. Well, for now, would you please welcome Mr. Bernard Thresher. How are you? All right. What do you make of that, then? If you're teaming up with a nice white sock, it really sets it off. <laughs> I 
I know what you're thinking, but married, so. <laughs> but Billy will be uh, taking calls later. <laughs> Right, while the lads are um, doing whatever the lads do while they send me up on my own, I'd like to play a little song for you on my own, if that's all right. It's a little song about going on a holiday with a loved one. Or you might meet somebody while you're there. It's, a, it's called cottaging. <laughs> Which, as far as I know, is just going on a holiday in a cottage. I don't know if, if you know any different, then... It's up to you. M make of it what you will, hold on. And you will, no. Because I haven't got the uh, lads behind me, I need you to be strong on the clap in front here to try and keep me in time. So I'll start playing as soon as you pick up the rhythm. Just uh, feel free to join in. Here we go. This is called Cottaging. <laughs> you can do better than that, come on. Otherwise this intro could go on for about 45 minutes. Summertime is here again and I'm going to have some fun Relax and meet new people, yes the party's just begun I suppose I could have gone cruising but that's really not my scene I want to expose myself to the great outdoors and you all know what I mean Cos I'm going cottaging Cottaging Oh, I feel so fancy free Cos I'm going cottaging Cottaging Come cottaging with me. Do you want the hot pots back on stage, ladies and gentlemen? Well, you're going to have to clap louder than that. Come on. To be having fun, what's fun like this? It's really not a crime. And I'll bend over backwards to make sure you have a good time. We could cottage in the north, we could cottage in the south. I know it's got a bad reputation, but I promise it won't leave a bad taste in your mouth. I'm going cottaging. 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 Oh, I feel so fancy free. Because I'm going cottaging. 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 Come cottaging with me. Come cottaging with me. Come cottaging with me. Come cottaging with me. All right, big ending like the Beatles. Here we go. Bom. 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 Cottaging in the countryside. That's right. Thank you. God bless you, thank you very much. Go on, Kenny. Is uh, Kenny Cam still working? Oh, she's flashing all right. Oh, the camera's working as well. Hey! hey! <laughs> but um, the bell tree's on stage, so it can only mean one thing. An ode to an eight-mile-an-hour tricycle. Here we go. It was better than that. Yeah. Do you know how long it took him to play that? Four years. Four years at the tech campus. He's got so, a beat at level two. <laughs> so let's try that again and really show your appreciation for his fingering skills. I was going downwards. They should have gone upwards then now, Burn. I read a letter in the star It were about a German market in the town Down the town 
They were selling fancy cheese and meat and continental wines And the author of the letter had to frown Cos was he gonna park? Was he gonna park? He shot mobility scooter Today Was he gonna park? Was he gonna park? Shop Mobility Scooters Hey, are you from Manchester's today? Yeah. In 2005 I heard a tale in the pub Big Frank were taking Scooter down to shop Well, halfway there he hit the curb and battery went flat Now he's stuck about half a mile from co-op And was he gonna charge? Was he gonna charge? Shop mobility scooter. Larry, let's hear you. Today, was he gonna charge? Was he gonna charge? Shop mobility scooter. Everybody. In 2006, I had me eye on for a sex. I was trying to impress this lovely last called G. Say lovely. I got myself a rascal painted lightning on the side. Now I'm courting, and it's thanks to me mean machine. But where am I going, poor Jean? Where am I going, poor Jean? On the shop mobility scooter. Today, where am I going, poor Jean? Where am I going, poor Jean? On the shop mobility scooter. Shop Mobility Just the top row, let's see ya. Very ambient. Next row down, come on, let's see ya. Very good. This whole bottom section, come on. Decibels. And everybody, let's go back in now, come on. Gina, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Nah. Thank you very much. <laughs>